Uh, we got more questions for the leader of the Conservative Party, John Cummins. Uh, let's go back to Jordan. Ba uh, yeah, Jordan Bateman, uh, Canadian Taxpayers Federation. Here's Jordan. Mr. Cummins, the medical services premium health care tax is a regressive, unfair tax for thousands of private sector British Columbians. Will a Conservative government eliminate the MSP, or at the very least, tie it to income levels? I mean, that's a good question. Uh, in some provinces in this country, the MSP is actually paid by, uh, by the provincial government. Uh, if there's an appetite for it, uh, it's possible to have that happen. I think the, the real issue probably is, uh, you know, the issue of fraud. That seems to be a big concern. Mm -hmm. It has been in the past. Um, my view, I guess, uh, when it comes to these MSP premiums and, and provide, provision of services that we really do need to... Uh, uh, have some way of identifying positively the person that's that's getting that service. Um, I was talking with someone the other day, and they said, "Well, here's the issue. I go into a into a clinic, into a hospital. Uh, I present my card. They say, "Well, are you uh, still so and so, and you still live at such and such address?" And he says, "Yes," and away he goes. He's going to get the service. Nobody's checking to make sure he is who he says he is, but it, that's the question that's asked. And I think that those are the kinds of things that we have to address. And and uh, first off. Uh, and uh, certainly the, the, the elimination of that MSP premium is, is uh, an idea that's worth investigating. Oh. Why do I support the Canadian Taxpayers Federation? Because families deserve a break. Because someone has to keep our politicians honest. Because honesty and hard work should be rewarded, not punished. Alone, my voice may not be heard. But together, our voices can't be ignored.